Hey, good morning everybody, it's Heather. Today is day 12 of the Les Mills Pump journey I am on. I'm doing some pump and burn again, so it's my second time doing it. I think I remember the weights I did last time and I'm probably gonna stick to them because I felt the burn early, early, early on and I wanted to quit. <laughs> so I'm gonna try that weight again. Um, I know I'll be doing this workout quite a few more times, so I'll have my chances to up the weights. Um, I thought that I was doing you know, intro weights that would still be challenging, but I would have been able to complete them the first time I did them, and I was proven wrong. The rep effect uh, crushed me after about two minutes, and since each set is five minutes long, it hurt. So um, let's go get started, and uh, excited to get warmed up because my body is needs it. So let's go. Back and down, and let your knees bend forward. Good job. Got the rhythm? Four, three, two, one, and up. A bit quicker now, on three. Three, two, now push up. That's right. Down, 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 and up. Of your body changing shape. So dig in. Let's go, single. Burn. Equals booty, baby. Honestly, who does that? What are the quick naked? Huh? All right. Let's go. For two, and up for two. This is our smooth tempo, so there's no clear start or stop for the movement. Alright? We got one more, but before that, we're gonna slow it down. Two and three and a one. So it's three, two, one, and back up. Three, two, one, and rise. Slightly off the floor and bend at the top. Alright, we've been here before. Bottom pass, give me two. Down, halfway up. Down and drive. That's it, guys. I know, the feeling of fatigue. Slower, three, up, two, one, and rise. Can you feel the difference? Every time we change the tempo on you, it has a response in the body. See if you can feel it. Up we go. Drive, get under the bar, and catch it. High on the chest. Come down, now listen up. Down below, triple row, one more time. Straight back down. Yes, still your body. What a great start. Who doesn't want a flat belly? Who doesn't want six packs? Feet up, back to extension. Arms and legs. So if you want to work a little harder, tip the foot slightly further away. Okay, okay, so I finished pump and burn and I it, it beat me this time. And it's weird because I use the exact same weights that I used the first time I did this, but um, the squat track I probably could have added on a little bit of a little bit more, but the chest track I was dying. Like I looked at the clock and it had only been a minute and thirty seconds, and I was like, "Wow, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish this." Um, I had to take probably two of my own personal breaks because it was just I felt like I was ripping my muscle fibers in my um, right in this area. So. Um, Okay, so I might not be upping my weights for chest next time, but I know that this is a weight that, um, you know, it will be, will be very, very, very challenging. Um, a couple questions I've gotten is about the bar with the squats and lunges, it being on the meaty part of your back, and um, it still hurts people. It still bothers me, and obviously the more weight you have, it may, you know, it'll still kind of rub up against your upper spine. They do make, I don't think Beachbody has it yet, um, I don't know if it's something they're going to get, but you could probably get it at a sports store. It's like a foam roll thing that goes over the bar, so it gives that support so it's not putting so much pressure on that area. Um, I know back when I was teaching this, it was a big problem, and it kind of prevented some people from doing heavier weights. But don't let that you know discourage you. You can still go get something, some type of padding that can go around. And I've seen people put wrap up a towel around the bar as well. Which next time I do it, I will attempt that so you guys can see, or I'll bring my towel down here and show you how to wrap it up. So, um, But that's it. Tomorrow is rest day, which I'm looking forward to. Um, much needed R&R, &R, so time to go start my day. And I hope everybody has a fantastic day. And if you are not doing Les Mills Pump, again, why are you not? Um, I want to hear from you. I want to know why you're not. Or if you are doing it, what is your favorite workout? Do you have any questions? Um, and if you're loving these videos and you're seeing my journey and you're like, yes, I want Les Mills Pump, uh, contact me. You can go to heatherfoltz.com and purchase it there. It's a great program. I highly recommend everybody do it. It's fantastic. So I want to hear from you, um, and we'll see you all later. Bye.